mega I'm sweating just because I'm already getting in character about today's video because I was so mad I was so mad that day so I'm mad right now welcome guys today's video is gonna be story time my eyebrow story time and how I got them done in the wrong place Anyways, let's get to the video. It was a nice afternoon. I, uh, I decided to go get my eyebrows done. I just didn't want to go in my old place. I want to, because it was so far away. Like, it was like quite a bit, quite a bit of a drive. It was like the other side of town. And, wait, rewind. First, I went to Facebook asking people of a place that you could trust to get your eyebrows done. I got a lot of comments about this one place. It's actually near my house. It's like within walking distance. So a lot of people told me about that place and they, you know, it's very cheap and you could definitely trust the lady that does it. And I was like, oh, cool, you know. Thanks guys. I'm gonna go there right now. And so I did. I walked in. I said, um, hi. Um, I need to get my eyebrows done. She's like, sure, um, just hold, hold on, have a seat, we'll be right with you. I was like, okay, I waited for like 10 minutes. I was like, okay, there was nobody there, it was kind of dead. That right there should have stopped me from getting my eyebrows done at that place because, uh, I don't know, I just don't trust places. Maybe I'm just being skeptical because, I don't know, I just don't trust. I didn't, that should have just stopped me right there. There was no one there. No one there. I mean, there was one lady getting her toes done, but like, that's it. I'm like, oh God. But you know, I'm gonna be a nice person. I'm gonna give this lady a try. So I went, I waited, I sat and waited. The lady came up to me. Hi, who are you? She was Asian, so I don't know how to do Asian accent, but she was like, hi, how are you? What do you want, what do you need done today? I need my eyebrows done. And I explained to her before I got up, like what I needed done. I needed, I said, ma'am, I need my eyebrows done correctly. I need them shaped. I need them defined and a little bit of an arch. I know it's crazy for a guy to get an arch, but I said a little bit, not a rainbow, not nothing, just a tiny bit, just so I could have a little bit of a definition on it. She's like, uh-huh, uh-huh. I was thinking, do you understand me? Do you speak English? Like that's all she was saying. Uh-huh, uh-huh. That's another clue right there. I should have just walked out. I was like, oh Lord, oh Lord. Started making my way down to the back of the salon. And I sat there and she was getting all prepared and everything. I was like, here it goes. Please take off your glasses. Sure, I guess. The lady didn't even tell me that the wax was hot. It was biting hot. It was hot. It was burning my skin. She put that wax on my on top of my eyebrows. I wanted to cry. I was like, it's so hot. You know, like, oh, I'm not used to that. Oh, and then she had the audacity to tell me, beauty hurts, honey, beauty hurts. I'm like, I know, but like, this is too much, you know, like, chill. And she just like kind of brushed me off, like ignored me. I'm like, you know, whatever. I endured the pain. She did her thing on the one eyebrow. I was like, um, before you go to the next eyebrow, can I look at what you did so far? She's like, uh -huh. I was like, mirror? Like, can I look at what you did? Your work? Can I look? And I looked around, I was like, oh, mirror, mirror, this. I didn't scream there, but in my head I was like, ah! Well, 
lady, what did you do? My eyebrows. Why? Why? Like, why? My voice just got really, really, really high pitch. I'm sorry, guys. I was like, why? Why? That is not what I told you to do. She's like, give me that, give me that. I'm like, I know, but that's wrong. That's not what you you should have done to my eyebrows. You arched my eyebrows. <laughs> oh my goodness, you arched them. I wanted to cry. I was terrified. I wasn't about to walk away, get up, go home with uh, one eyebrow done. No. That, I mean, it was hideous already. It would have looked even more horrendous if I just walked out like that. I was like, Lord, Lord, take the wheel. Proceed, I guess. So she continued doing the other eyebrow. I was like, Lord, this pain is too much. This lady messed up my eyebrows. She messed up my eyebrows. And I have to stay here through the pain. I'm like, I did not want to pay her when I was done. I was like, I was I was thinking, should I pay this lady? You definitely ain't getting no tip. Mm -mm. I ain't paying, I ain't tipping your ass. Mm -mm. Nope. I shouldn't even pay you. But if those of you that know me knows I'm a nice person. I don't cause a scene. I don't, none of that. I, I paid the lady and I went home and I cried. I opened the door of my house. I cried, I sobbed on the couch. I laid on my couch. I did not want to see or talk to anybody. My mom came in the living room. She's like, why are you crying? Why are you crying, honey? I'm like, I looked at her. She's ah! I'm like, what? What is wrong with your face? <laughs> my eyebrows. <laughs> this lady messed up my eyebrows. <laughs> my mom was. Oh my lord, she didn't even know what to say to me at that time. She just walked away and I was like, good, I don't want to talk to you either, so go. I love you though, mom, but no. She went up to her room and I stayed in my on the couch crying and crying and crying. I wrote a, a really bad review on the on that salon. I'll post it right here. And um, I was mad. I was terrified. I I did not like my eyebrows, of course. Um, I remember I didn't go anywhere. I mean, I did go places that I had to go, but like I was like, don't look at my eyebrows. Don't. Mm -mm. And um, oh yeah, and I also forgot to show you how it looked like, right? That's how it looked like. It was hard. Anyways, that was my story. I hope you guys somewhat enjoyed the video. And here's a tip. Don't go to a nail salon to get your eyebrows done. Oh, and do not get your eyebrows done where when the lady doesn't know how to speak English. She will mess up your eyebrows. And you will be crying the next the next day or when you're out of there so yeah just move on don't even go in the salon if the lady doesn't doesn't speak english or just don't take my advice and run so that's it guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video i know i feel bad just watching this video myself um 
I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next Wednesday with a brand new video. And my phone just died. So yeah, guys, I hope you guys have a great day and make sure to follow me on social media. It'll be somewhere on this video or down below in the description box. I'll see you next time. Bye. If I had it my way, I would take you down